Hey, welcome back to the Hot Foot Carnival series. Now, if you know anything about traditional carnival, you must know about the Dame Lorraine, the lady with the huge boots, the huge butt, a mask, and a fan. But did you know that the Dame Lorraine is actually from a whole family of forgotten characters that all have exaggerated body parts? And traditionally, the Dame Lorraine is actually played by a man. On Carnival Sunday night in the Jammed Yards, there was a particular band of masked characters who all paraded with an exaggerated or sick body part. They all had French Creole names that reflected their infirmity. Now let's look at the words. It would be Ma or Madame for ladies and Monsieur or Monsieur for men. And Go means big. Go Tet had a big head. Go Bunda had a big buttocks. Go Tete had big breasts. Go Coco had a big, well, you know. Go Boudin had a big belly and so on and so on. These characters were all collectively called Damlerine or Damlerine. So the character that we know as Damlerine is actually a hybrid of Go Tete and Go Bunda, which were previously worn by two separate people. Cross-dressing is a part of performance and masquerade traditions in many cultures, including ours. Not to mention that mask was a male-dominated activity at a point in time, so you'd often find that men dress as women in jammed masks and vice versa. Today, the Damlerine's other caricature of cousins aren't nearly as popular as she is, but if you're lucky, you'll find them all together in a traditional mask portrayal. So, like this video if you knew that, comment if you didn't, and share it either way. That's that on that. Crick crack, monkey break his back on a piece of opera.